Yo, what's going on, everyone? It's your boy Komal HD, and here we are. We are in the Super Bowl for my season with the Browns slash Ohio State slash Ohio theme team, if you want to call it. We were probably five and three, four and three with my last team that I ended up blowing it all up. Got this, and you know we've been on a win streak ever since. A lot of close games. Lot, everything was happening, you know. One of my playoff games, I got lucky. We joined me and the kid, bought a kickoff, disconnected. Luckily, Madden went in my favor and gave me that win. But here we're playing a just an all-around, you know, normal speed team. We got wide receiver Dion. He had rugs at punt returner, and that's where my team comes into comes with an issue. I get beat by the deep ball a lot. If you watch this play. Thank God he doesn't have Mahomes or Josh Allen because look at this. Easy. Easy. He, if he has dashing dead eye or any of those abilities, that's a touchdown. I'm down 7 nothing first 30 seconds of the game. So I go into dollar here. I go cover for a drop. I try backing everyone up because I, I know my weakness is the deep ball. So I'm trying to prevent that as much as I can. Only bad, pro only bad thing is whenever I go into dollar... Since I have such like a small like team, I guess you want least amount of people. I have Michael Thomas or Odell, but Dante Jackson gets the pick there. Read that perfectly, and then just like that, we got the ball on offense in the Super Bowl. My whole goal was just to come out here, get some easy passes in. I wasn't trying to turn. I'm not trying to throw deep. I'm not trying to turn the ball over. Just trying to play conservative. No turnovers. I usually win every game. Then there's Austin Hooper, breaks a tackle, moves forward, easy four yards. And yeah, my whole team, I got, so I got Brown, so how to say, I got Baker at QB, Eddie George at running back, then I got Odell, Michael Thomas, and then I got some few pieces like a Dory Jackson, who I still got to replace, I'm going to try getting Terry McLaurin. But yeah, there goes Eddie George, he's just trucking over everyone. I noticed this kid can't stop the run. So I remember that later in the game, I start to abuse the run because he just can't. Eddie George is just running over everyone. But yeah, my O-line, it's all Browns besides my center is uh, Snow Beast 94 Jason Kelsey. And I'll probably get Alex Mack, I'm not sure. I kind of like Jason Kelsey even though he doesn't fit the team. He's kind of just really good. I can't quick sell him for anything or get any value. So he's just stuck. There's a Dory Jackson, the one outlier of this, of this offense too. But yeah, we're over here. Already in the red zone here. We're moving forward. Now, same thing. Just gonna run up the middle. He has no one on his D-line with inside stuff, which is ridiculous. Look at that. Just easy. Five, six yards every single time. He can't stop it. Inside stuff is definitely one of the best abilities. I have it on my D-tackle, Sheldon Richardson. It blows up every inside zone. It's ridiculous. So here we're looking through a play. Jet toss, jet toss is one of my favorite things. Even Michael Thomas, who's slower than any other wide receiver I have. He gets a few solid solid yards every time I usually run it, but he blows it up here, so I just try getting a few yards, breaking it up the middle. And then same thing, he can't stop the run. Third and two, it's obvious run scenario. Look at this, he pinches the D-line. He knows what's coming. Easy. Look at that. Easy. Another five, four or five yards. He can't stop it. So I know that he likes running Tampa too, so I could I could beat him down the middle. But I just don't think he can stop the run. Here we go with another. We're going halfback dive right up the middle. No D tackles with inside stuff. He can't stop the middle. Look at this. Just easy. Just right. Bang. No one's coming even close to touching him on the contact. It's just that easy. So we're back on defense here after that drive. I said it earlier, I'm going to say it again. We already know what's going to happen here. Playing cover four. We got 
My sub linebacker is Malcolm Jenkins, 91. He's an Ohio State player. But look at this. Just gone. He's just. Lattimore gone. Eddie, none of them can. Eddie Jackson, another outlier of the team. But it's just that quick. That quick. He just flew to. I don't even. I couldn't even tell you who that wide receiver is if my life depended on it. So there he goes. He ties the game back up 7 7. We got 38 seconds in the first quarter. He already made a comeback. So let's see what we can do here on the offensive drive. So here we go. We are back on offense. Just like I said last time, just run out the middle. He's not stopping it. Look at that. Easy. He's not getting close to stopping it. Once I found out he can't stop the run, it's just all I'm doing. Same thing. He pinches the deal and he knows what's coming. Bang. There it is again. Another four or five yards. He just can't stop the run. So that's all we're going to do the drive. We're just going to set up the run like this. Move Odell. See if he's running man or just see if it gets him a little distracted. Odell stops. Same thing. Hand off to Eddie George. Look at this. Look at that. Look at that hole. Just jukes him out. Just too easy. He has no one to stop the run. Eddie George is just feasting on him right now. So same thing. I, I'm inside the red zone again. That's It's been like 30 seconds to a minute. I'm already in the red zone. Just running. Same thing. This time we're going to kick it out wide. We've been running inside zone and halfback dives. We've been running up the middle. We're going to kick it out wide. He pinches it, so that's perfect. Runs out wide. Good block right there. Just no one's stopping him. No one is stopping him. It's just too easy. You got to have a D tackle with inside zone. Or else this is just going to happen. You're just going to get ran up the middle all game. You need inside zone. Kicking it off, and here here goes Henry Ruggs. Just 98 speed. Look at him. I thought he was gone. Look at, thank God for Eddie Jackson. Thank God Eddie Jackson's here. But when this happened, I thought, you know what? It might not be that bad because I get burned deep anyway. So if the shield or the field, my fault, shrinks, I might be able to force another pick because I just get beat deep anyway. First play of the drive, he's got 43 yards to go. Look at that. I should have used that. But like I said, Michael Thomas is out there on defense because I don't have that many players on here. And here we go. He's he's about in the red zone, 25 more yards to go. Play action pass. Look at that. He sees it. Bang. Steve Atwater picks it off. Perfect. Perfect read by Steve Atwater. We get the ball back 93 yards to go. Two minutes left in the half. So I'm continuing with the run here. He pinches the line again. I'm going to kick it out to the right, and here we go. There goes Eddie George. Jukes out that guy. We just got one man to beat. And here we go. Uh, blows past him. That's it. No one's catching Eddie George right there. 93 yards to the house. Three touchdowns in the Super Bowl for Eddie George, and look at that. All right. There he goes. So we won the Super Bowl. And yeah. Thanks for tuning in. Be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you.